हेलो एवरी वन माई नेम इज़ हर्षिता बसीरा एंड आई वेलकम यू ऑल टू माई यूट्यूब चैनल सो टूडेज वीडियो इज ऑल अबाउट वॉट आर द बेस्ट रिसोर्स टू लर्न डेटा एनालिटिक्स और बिजनेस एनालिटिक्स इन शॉर्ट एनालिटिक्स ओके सो टूडेज इन टूडेज वीडियो आई एल बी शेयरिंग वॉट रिसोर्स आई पर्सनली यूज टू लर्न एनालिटिक्स एंड uh what which platform help me a lot for practicing every tool like power bi sql excel and uh, many uh, all many things to uh, and uh, the list of the resources that helps me and which can help you a lot also uh i probably think so so without any further delay let's get jump into okay now let's first focus on sql that is structured query language okay so there are lots of resources free resources uh, so yeah so one thing which i want to clear that whatever resources i'll be sharing that uh, they all are free of cost okay so yeah uh, coming back to the topic so uh, talking about sql so uh, i have uh, used uh rishab mishra's sql playlist uh you might be aware of that so uh you can go for that uh and why you can uh, go for that playlist is that uh is because that you will learn all the foundational topic in a theory as well as in a some practical uh form also so i would suggest if you are a beginner and you are not aware what exactly sql is then i would suggest uh, you can go for rishab mishra's sql playlist to get some idea about each topic okay uh, so you can uh, like at least clear your foundations now you have completed that uh, playlist now i would suggest try to go for uh, websites like a uh, uh, hacker rank a uh, lead code data limer these are the websites where you can practice sql related questions so i have personally completed many uh, practices many uh, questions on hacker rank lead code and or uh, data limer one thing which uh, here i want to emphasize to you is that that we know that sql has many uh, easy to hard questions so if you are a beginner then i would suggest first you can go for hacker rank website where they uh, the question set is uh, comparatively easier than lead code and data limer so if you are beginner then i would suggest complete the all Uh, questions uh, in hacker rank and on the five star uh, five star batch then go for lead code and then go for uh, data limer now uh, as you have uh, uh, like get idea about uh, some resources from youtube as well as from websites now how you can practice on your own so where this is where chat gpt comes so whenever i uh, get a free time i used to open chat gpt and enter a prompt that uh, like uh, give me some set of sql questions on a uh, easy medium and hard level and s uh, and uh, chat gpt will give you a set of questions based on the level you ask them in their prompt so uh, you can practice that uh, you know questions also uh, if you want to practice more so in this way you can even get help from the chat gpt you can even get a help from chat gpt if you are uh, like uh, if you want to build the uh, project uh, based on the sql Uh, by getting some idea from the chat gpt or you can even ask for the some uh, thousands of uh, data from the chat gpt itself so i have personally used chat gpt in that in that way so you can try that too okay now uh, let's come to the next topic that is for the power bi okay okay now let's come to the second point that is Uh, resources for the power bi so here uh, uh like if you are a beginner then you can go for a uh, chandu's youtube channel where uh, he shared a 
uh, playlist for solely for the power bi itself so like i personally uh, complete or uh, i watched all the videos from their playlist so you can go for that also here whatever resources i'm sharing is uh, i'm assuming that you are beginner and you don't have any knowledge about analytics and their respective tools like uh, when i had uh, zero knowledge about analytics i personally used all these resources to get some foundation idea of what exactly these all tools are and how we can uh, practice all these tools along with these um, you know preparations so uh, if you are a beginner then i would suggest go for these kinds of resources and when you completed all your foundations you can go for advanced topic as well so you will get some idea about that but here whatever uh, resources i'm sharing is uh, focusing on the beginners to get some idea about it okay let's again come to the topic so if you want to get some idea about the power bi then you can go for the chandu chandu's youtube channel where he shared a playlist of the power bi uh, once you completed all the videos in the playlist you get some idea about the power bi and like how you can create dashboards and reports how to use power query and everything related to the power bi and once you completed uh, all the uh, once you watched all the videos you can go for the uh, your own projects or as well as guided unguided projects okay again how you can use chat gpt for practicing uh, uh, the tool power bi so again i used to uh, you know uh, like write a uh, command or a prompt in chat gpt to chat gpt to get some uh, data set uh, like e-commerce data set uh, data sets or sales data set etc and from that data you can uh, you know ask uh, uh, chat gpt like which kind of uh, graphs or charts and uh, which kind of analysis we can done with that with this kind of uh, data set or you can go for your uh, own way like uh, if you want to explore the data set on your own and create your own dashboard so you can go for that as well as you can take the help of chat gpt so you can uh, uh, like decide uh, based on your requirements and uh, one thing which uh, again i used to uh, get help from the chat gpt is like whenever you get any uh, you uh, have any doubt or uh, on uh, any particular topic so you can uh, easily take help from the chat gpt like uh, this is the like can you explain me that data modeling uh, concept in a uh, uh, very easy uh, understanding language so uh, chat gpt is helpful in that way uh, uh, not alone for the power bi but for excel for sql and for python itself so you can take help from the chat gpt in that way also now comes to the excel part so for excel i also used chandu's youtube channel where he shared many tips and tricks related to excel so you can go for that also and uh, lastly for the python you can go for a youtube channel called code with hari uh, where he shared a one uh, full uh, uh, lengthy video related to the python so i'm personally uh, like watching his uh, python related videos for data analysis so you can uh, watch his video also for python like if you want to learn python okay now comes the most important part that is the projects so for projects there are some web uh, some youtube channels which i personally loved it uh, and you will learn a lot if you uh, watch their videos and understand what exactly they want to uh, tell you in their video so the number one is natasha sevilraj yes she is like i would consider her as in a, a top one uh, uh, from all the uh, resources which i have shared uh, earlier uh, why because the kind of knowledge she shared and the kind of ideas she shared 
are related to the ideas uh, or the on the projects of data analytics or data scientists you will learn a lot secondly uh, you will also learn uh, how to stand out as a data analyst fresher as well as experience but mostly fresher uh, so if you watch her videos and if you already watched her videos i would uh, and if you have not uh, like watched her videos, I would strongly recommend her to at least uh, uh, like watch one of her video. You will learn a lot, lot of things and uh, in a very new way. So uh, if you have, haven't subscribed her channel, so I would recommend because I have personally learned a lot from her YouTube channel. So for projects for standing out as an analyst, you should go for Natasha Sevalraj YouTube channel. Now, second point, again for the projects itself, second YouTube uh, channel is uh, uh, Code Basics. You will learn a lot, uh, like they shared many good uh, projects. So uh, you can go for that. And third is, uh, third YouTube channel is Lore, so what? Yes. Uh, where uh, in the in the in his YouTube channel, you will learn a lot of new ways to do a projects in Tableau as well as in Power BI as well as in Excel also. So you should go for uh, like at least check out his YouTube channel. So you will learn a lot uh, from Natasha Sevilraj, Code Basics, and Lorso for uh, Lorso what yes. So these are the webs, uh, sorry, YouTube channel where you will learn about the projects uh, related to data analytics. I am not uh, here. I am not saying that they are sharing the guided projects. Yeah, lore. So what and code basics are sharing the guided projects also. But if you want some ideas related to what kind of projects you want, or uh, you should go for that. So you can recommend, uh, like I would recommend uh, Natasha Sebrach. So in short, for project related to analytics, you, you can go for these three channels, okay? And the last uh, YouTube channel which I personally want to share with you is that Learn With Kids. Why? Because uh, in the whole uh, journey of becoming an uh, analyst, you will uh, experience lots of ups and downs and uh, there were there were a f there will be a phase where you feel very demotivated uh, because of uh, lots of competition in this field so in that case you need some kind of a motivation so for that you can go for learn with skip uh, learn with kids yeah why because uh, in uh, uh, in that youtube channel you uh, many students or freshers as well as experienced even a career gaps uh, candidates uh, or peoples uh, share their journey like how they ended up with the data analytics or business analytics field so uh, you will learn how they uh, prepare how they have completed their uh, you know the learning phase uh, the job hunting phase resume preparation everything or what uh, what extra they have done uh, to stand out in the competitive job market so all these things uh, if you want to uh, like get some kind of a motivation you can go for learn with gigs as well as they also shared some interview related uh, you know questions uh, in power bi also so you can go for that website uh, sorry youtube channel also which uh, like i have used also so you can go for that also okay wait if you are still watching my video so i would like to recommend one more thing to you so uh, in my whole three or four months of job hunting phase i have learned so many uh, things about making 
a standout resume so uh, and all uh, and most importantly i have done many mistakes and learn from that mistakes also and i also utilize chat gpt for how to overcome all the mistakes which i have done in making my resume so if you want if you do not want to repeat those mistakes and want the solutions if you are doing that mistakes then i would recommend to uh, check out my ebook which uh, and its name is my 10 mistakes in resume making now become lessons link in the comment bye bye okay wait if you are still watching my video so i would like to recommend one more thing to you so uh, in my whole 3 or 4 months of job hunting phase i have learned so many uh, things about making a stand out resume so uh, and uh, and most importantly i have done many mistakes and learn from that mistakes also and i also utilize chat gpt for how to overcome all the mistakes which i have done in making my resume so if you want if you do not want to repeat those mistakes and want the solutions if you are doing that mistakes then i would recommend to uh, check out my ebook which uh, and its name is my 10 mistakes in resume making now become lessons link in the comment bye bye